Coach, just talk to us. Obviously, an emotional game. Your boys fought to the very end. Just, you know, what do you, what is your emotions right now? Just, I don't, it, it, real numb. You know, uh, just real proud. Number one, hats off to Bowden. I mean, they, we played them four times in the last two years, and both times, the second game, they got better as the year went on. Just hats off to them. First class program, championship program all the way. You know, our kids right now are the most important thing. We got 48 of them in there right now. They're hurt. Um, you know, the big message to them right now is don't ever cry about the result. You know, you know it's over. It matters. You know, be, you know, you crave about all that. Um, you know, tight we got here. You know, of course, we had a lot of distractions. And, uh, you know, our, all those people right there, our community, those people watching at home, they had a lot of, they were looking to us for strength tonight. And those 48 young men, those 15, 16, 17-year-olds that already got there and showed it. I'm just super, super proud of them. You know, we never once looked at the scoreboard. Um, you know, you know, we made some bad coaching decisions in the game. I did. I take all four spots of that. You know, just emotion right now, just still numb. You know, um, it's been such a long road this year, and those our kids have risen up every time. I'm so proud of them. Uh, when you get done tonight, you get to get our roster. It's on maxpreps.com. Make sure you stamp in the brain those names that are on it because they're all really tough individuals. Really proud of them. And uh, just uh, it's all about them right now. It's all about them. Coach, it was a tough start. It was a tough start today. You fell down 14 nothing. But what did it say about your kids? Everything they've been through the last 48 hours, they didn't. They came right back and took the lead. They. It just you've got to see what was on the inside of them. That's what I can tell you. I mean. They, you know, they work out and everybody's got, you know, muscles and that type deal, you know, physically what you see on the outside, but you got to see what was on the inside of them right there. And we fell down those two scores early and, uh, you know, they just kept coming and kept coming. We just ran that gas right there at the end. Coach, when I talked to you earlier this week, you talked about how proud you were of this team and that was before everything that happened. You know, just what does, what will be your lasting memory of this team despite everything you guys have gone through? Just, uh, you know, it wasn't our time. And we're being prepared for something greater. We're being prepared for something greater. And, uh, you know, I just told them, Stephen's told them greater things. We said that every week to them. And, uh, and it is, I mean, you know, we're going, you know, we're going to be, you know, have our time in there because it's over. But, uh, but they, they, they are being prepared for something greater. What would be your message? If you could talk to Brandon, if you could talk to him right now, what would be your message? Oh, man, he just loved him. I have my arms around him right now. He, uh, he was his own kid. He was his own guy. And a uh, very important part of us getting here. And, uh, you, know, it, you know, it's just all numb right now. It's just all numb right now, to be honest with you. A lot of honorees today, Coach. What kind of was that $100 going to be? I'm sorry? A lot of honorary 5-2 today with the stickers. And the oh, yeah. I mean, you know, it just in the short amount of time we had, that was, you know, what we could do. Cause we, you know, our, our number one thing in our message to our players is that people are important. You know, people, human lives are important. And then your teammates being people, you know, they're more important than things. Weight rooms and gyms and all that stuff. And, and you know, he mattered. He, he, he mattered a lot. And a lot of people never saw a lot of what he did to make a difference on this football team. But he mattered. And we want to make sure that every one of our players remember that. And, uh, you know, they did. We knew it was Carolyn Boy. I'm sure the public remembered it too. Thank y'all very much, y'all. I appreciate all y'all.